Jay Carter of Carter Aviation Technologies is the first engineer to successfully use slowed rotor technology. The advantages of slowed rotor compound is that it gives us better speed, better efficiency, and better safety than any other aircraft. His first prototype was called the CCTD for Carter Copter Technology Demonstrator. It's an aircraft, it's a gyro, it's a helicopter. You know, it's a hybrid. By combining all three of these, we got an aircraft that can take off and land vertically like a helicopter, yet flies fast and efficient as a fixed wing airplane. Rotors, especially on gyroplanes, create enormous drag, which limits airspeed. It took Jay seven years to work out what had to be done with the rotors for high-speed flight. And on June 17, 2005, he proved what everyone had said was impossible. He slowed the rotor down enough to almost eliminate any drag, thereby increasing his airspeed. He achieved what's called mu one, where the airspeed equals the rotor tip speed. The advantages of Mu-1 are the fact that we've been able to slow the rotor down so much that it now basically disappears. From a drag standpoint, it basically disappears. Nobody had ever done this before. After we broke Mu-1, um, we ended up on the very next flight having an accident. And, uh, and nobody was hurt, but we did pretty well tear up the aircraft. Feel filler camp. Today, Jay's team is flight testing the latest prototype. Oh, all surfaces. Good. Propeller and spinner. Good. You ready? Okay. Yeah, ready. Yep. The vehicle can either take off with a short taxi run, or it can take off vertically. That's not what gyroplanes normally do. So when we spin this rotor up like this, there's a whole lot of stored up energy, like a flywheel. And so we literally can jump in the air on just the stored up energy that we have in the rotor blade. Over the next year, Jay will keep testing his prototype and improving his slowed rotor system. After that, he plans on scaling up the challenge. 